subtropical ridge, which reaches its most northern position in winter, around 40 degrees south, bringing settled conditions. The onset of this regular weather pattern makes Gulf St. Vincent an ideal cruising ground all year round, the cross-gulf voyage to Port Vincent being a favourite with local sailors. Crouse 4, Gulf St. Vincent. Winds east to northeastly 10 to 15 knots, increasing to 15 to 20 knots in the south late, e late evening. Seas around 1 metre. Swell south to southwesterly below 1 metre. Weather sunny. Forecast for Friday 11th of September. Winds northeasterly. 15 to 20 knots, easing to northerly 10 to 15 knots late morning, then shifting southerly 15 to 20 knots during the evening. Seas 1 to 1 decimal 5 metres, decreasing below 1 metre around midday. Swell south to southwesterly below 0 decimal 5 metres, weather partly cloudy. 20 knots out at uh, Black Pole, blowing us off the uh, top. That uh, makes it problematic in terms of not uh, blowing into the boat next door. So using the spring line, we can uh, just use it as a centre plate and uh, drop it over the uh, mid earth cleat. You wouldn't leave it here unattended, but because it's uh, fully attended, as we would call it in the flight test world, and that uh, we're watching what the boat does all the time, we can afford to have it just around the forward part of the cleat. The boat will stay close to the dock until we're actually to move off means that I can then release the other lines without having to run and uh, that way when we're ready to go I can just release it here so it releases the tension and motor forward. Free now and coming forward. Main slope single-handed uh, make use of the J24 snatch block, which is uh, useful because it takes the load of the sail while well, you get a new grip. And as it starts getting too heavy, you can start leaning into the uh, halyard to uh, take the sail. Up. When you're finished actually hoisting the sail, when you take the load on the winch, the block is rigged such that it snaps out of the uh, cleat and you're then able to uh, operate it normally.
Sea Rescue Adelaide, Sea Rescue Adelaide. This is sailing vessel, the bottom line, the bottom line on channel 80, over. The bottom line, Sea Rescue Adelaide, go ahead. Yeah, Sea Rescue Adelaide, bottom line, we're just out of Port Vincent Marina now, I'd like to log off, thanks. The bottom line, this is Sea Rescue Adelaide, Romeo, that, um, thank you for Okay, this is where hopefully the um, lubrication has done its job. The main will come down largely without assistance. So when you're single handed, it makes life much, much easier. We've got some seals in the uh, entrance of the marina just on the starboard side, uh, just in the water. Um, so just keeping an eye on the depth here. It's 1.3 metres of tide. 1.7 at the moment. a bit of throttle and rudder we can actually um, bring the boat alongside and back into position. All stations, all stations, all stations. This is Victor Mike Romeo 502 Sea Rescue Adelaide. Winds north to northeasterly, 10 to 15 knots becoming variable, about 10 knots in the middle of the day, then shifting southerly, 15 to 20 knots in the evening. Seas 1 to 
1.5 metres, decreasing to 1 metre during the, during the morning. Swell. South to southwesterly below 0.5 metres. Weather mainly cloudy. Message ends. This is Sea Rescue Adelaide out. Before I leave, uh, use some silicon lubricant just on the um, cars, on the slugs, and the mast track. So uh, the last thing you want is for the sail to jam or to have problems getting it up or down, uh, particularly when you're reefing. So just a few squirts of that uh, once a month or so. Uh, make sure they stay nice and lubricated. After a very fluky afternoon coming across the Gulf where we had uh, winds of less than five knots from uh, all points of the compass at one stage. It's settled in now to be quite a good southeasterly, about 10 to 12 knots and we're getting around five and a half, six knots across a pretty flat sea. So anticipate being back into North Haven um, around 10 to 5. Uh, which is pretty much in accordance with what I told Sea Rescue Adelaide. Mm -hmm.